Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tech. In this video, we'll talk about disk management or disk partitions. Many times you may have issues with the disk partitions or with the disk recovery or whatever, but actually the tool disk management, which is provided from Microsoft in Windows 11 or Windows 10, doesn't allow us to do all the functions to properly manage the partitions that we have in our computer. For example, I want to extend the size of my partition C, where it is my operating system, and if I click with the right of the mouse over the operating system partition, and as you can see, I cannot extend this volume. I cannot extend this partition. And right now, for example, it's just 150 and I have around 290 gigabyte, which is unallocated. And I want to allocate at least 100 gigabyte more to the C drive. But fortunately, there are some softwares which you can use to do this task and many more with your disks or with your partitions. This tool that I will introduce to you guys today, it's called Mini Tool. And they have just released the latest version for partitions, which is called Mini Tool Partition Wizard 3, and the edition is 12.8. There is also a pro edition and a free edition. I will walk you through and compare between those two during the video. Quickly, what's new in version 12.8? It's an improved interaction and user interface. And actually, this is interesting that Minitool is very user-friendly and it has a brand new search box and there are some bug fixes with this version. The main functions of Minitool is this partition management, this partition conversion, and also you can check and fix file system errors by using the Minitool. Interesting is that you can convert between MBR and GPT. So now let's install this tool. Let's download the free edition of mini tool. It's just 3.1 megabyte to download. I'll just run it right away. I'll choose the English language. And here it is the comparison between the free edition and the pro edition. So basically you will have the basic disk partition management with the free edition. But if you want to use the functions like migrate operating system, copy operating system, copy operating system partition, convert the disk from MBR to GPT, then you're going to need the pro edition. Also, if you want to recover a lost partition, you will need the pro edition. But if you just want the disk partition management tools, then you can just install the free edition. So you just choose continue installing free edition, then you click over next, and then next again, I'm not going to change the default location where it's installed, click again next, and then it will take some minutes to install. All right, here it is. Mini tool partition wizard is installed on my computer. Let's run it right away. And let's walk through the functions that this tool provides. So quickly, you will see the possibility to be great operating system to another SSD. You can copy partition, you can copy disk, etc., etc., And also you can recover the complete partition. In this case, I just want to do the same thing that I wanted to do with the disk management tool of Windows. So I want to extend the C drive. So let's go and let's select the C drive. And then we click with the right of the mouse. And here you can see all the different functions that you can apply over this disk partition, which actually it's quite obvious that there are many more than the tools that provide disk management. So here it is. Let's go and extend it. Now you have to specify from where you're going to take this free space. It's quite powerful because you can take it also from an existing drive, which has some free space on that. But in this case, I just want to choose an unallocated space. And here you can specify the minimum size or the maximum size. So how much free space do you want to take? I'm just going to make it like 200 gigabyte. So here you can see also the new size of C, what will be. I'm going to just leave it with this one, so 200 gigabyte. And then I'm going to have around 240 gigabyte unallocated space, but that's fine because I want to use it for something else. Once you are done with this customization, you just click over OK, and then you have to click over Apply. And now we just say yes, and 
this operation will start and as you can see it's over quite fast applied all the pending changes successfully and if we see now c drive is showing now 200 gigabyte let's go to disk management and let's see yes also here it's around 200 gigabyte good so this was one of the functions that we couldn't do there and we can do here also you can merge partitions if you want to merge one partition with another one you can do it here converting from different file system from example ntfc to fat you cannot do it with the free edition actually it's just pro edition but if you need that function you just have to buy the pro edition which is around 60 dollars per year now data recovery is also a really powerful tool which you can use in this case i'm just going to use it for testing i'm going to try to recover some data from windows c or let's say from c partition i'm just gonna select this here and now as you can see it's calculating or it's scanning the c drive and trying to recover what's needed to be recovered from there well as you can see already it's showing some of the lost files deleted files or whatsoever you can walk through and try to find the files that you are missing if you are trying to recover some specific files that you have lost from your computer in this case specifically on the partition c i cannot introduce all the functions with this video but you can play around with this free edition of mini tool partition and i'm pretty sure that you'll find the functions that you may be looking for another one for example you can create a bootable media by just clicking here bootable media etc etc so that's all that i wanted to introduce to you guys i hope you like this video and i hope that you'll find useful mini tool partition wizard the free edition 12.8 and also the pro edition is out there if you need more functions like partition recovery or whatsoever thanks a lot for watching and please consider subscribing to our channel if you like our content wish to you all the best thank you